What it do, what it do, what it do, YouTube. It's your boy N-O-R-E-K. We are back in the building, baby, with another one. All exclusive. It's my boy, man. My boy, my boy finally made it. You see what he rocking? You see what he rocking? Got the Belize on that joint. You know what I'm saying? Stand up. My guy, Bullet. You dig? Uh, man, we got a big fight coming up, man. My boy, Bullet, uh, he training Raleigh Romero. Coming upcoming fight May 28. Y'all tap in, man. Order your pay per view. Get your internet right. Make sure you make sure you tune in, man. It's gonna be a good fight. Hopefully, hopefully. You know, it's a lot of a lot of hype behind it, and I'm I'm hoping for a good fight, man. Hey, again, Belize, stand up. Y'all see what he rocking? You know what I'm saying? Throwing that big Belize up, man. I need one of them. I need one of them bullet. Um, but yeah, I know this guy personally, man. I know him personally, man. Back in, in North Las Vegas, all over Vegas, man. At the Pal Palomino. Hey, well, if you see this, you already know I ain't lying. You know what I'm saying? Remember the Palomino, North Las Vegas. You already know it goes down. It goes down. I'm talking about digital in that motherfucker. But, you know, besides that, man, my boy, I didn't watch my dude come up from uh, being a like a promoter, a uh, party promoter. Um, club promoter, he didn't did he don't wore many different hats. He been in the boxing and the in the in the grappling. He even did the UFC. I remember when you was doing UFC, bro. When you was doing your thing, and then you finally you open your gym, and then you start doing your thing, training fighters. And man, look at you now, bro. That's a blessing, dog. It's a blessing, big dog. But yeah, fair use only on this video. I'm just gonna play a little bit uh, just so he can get some insight on his fighter, uh, Rolando Romero. Um, they call him Roly Romero. Got the upcoming fight against Tank Davis, Gervonta Tank Davis. You know, we all know Tank a beast. We done seen what he can do in the ring. Uh, Riley, this is his shot at the big leagues. At the, you know, I'm just going to keep it G. But, hey, man, salute to my boy Bullet, man. Mr. Cromwell himself. Belize, yeah, man. Respect, my G. But, yeah, fair use on this video, man. We just going to let it play a little bit. Let my man give his, uh, give his take on what's going to happen. Let's see. See, he rocking that belt. Yeah. Hey, Chief, how's it going? Hey, I wanted to just talk to you, man, to come about. You said you guys got to work. You guys can eye contact. You can make the eye contact to kind of establish your where you guys are going for. Controlling is emotions, though. How do you see that? How, how do you see that? Is that an issue in this in this fight? There's never been an issue with Ronnie. Ronnie's emotions are out of control. Ronnie's just a dog. Okay. People think, oh, that he's, that he's under control. Okay. He's complete. If I feel like he's out of control, I'll check him outside of his face. Hey, calm the fuck down. Okay. Listen. I have to do that. When I'm looking in his face, and I can tell him, certain listen, close my eyes, I'm a billion burgers. You know what I'm saying? But he knows. Green light. He knows red light. He knows when to box. He knows when to move. Okay. You see what I'm saying? It's totally orchestrated. Okay. You know what I'm saying? What we do in a fight, in a fight round for round, I don't gotta say shit to him doing a round. When you when come back to that corner, I'm gonna say two or three things to him. Okay. Not too much information, just two or three basic things that he knows exactly about. Okay. Are you, are you expecting this to go to distance? No. No, no, no. You got a prediction for us? Hey, like I said, my guy been a serious dude, man. He 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 put himself in there, so he ain't just talking just cause, just to be talking. Yeah, he got to hype the fight up for sure. But I believe in what this man is saying. Now, I'm not saying he, you know, Roly gonna knock Tank out or no shit like that. I don't know. Well, that's yet to be determined. But he stand on what he say, man. This dude's a stand up dude, man. Again, salute to my boy Bullet. You know, what I'm saying for finally making it to the. To the stage you on now, bro. You worked hard. It's been a long time coming, man. So you deserve everything that's coming your way. And I hope I hope the best for y'all. You know what I'm saying? I hope it's a good fight. And, man, just turn up, bro. And prove these haters wrong. You feel me? Oh, man, it's going to be a good one. Oh, man, like, I'm thinking before the second round. Okay. Because I think, uh, well, I know, Tank always gas us out. We have to take rounds off. We have to take no rounds off. We condition hard. We run hard. Okay. We run. These guys run a five miles. They think doing something. We run a 12 plus. You know what I'm saying? We run a mountain. So, you know what I'm saying? That boy got legs out this world. So, see these boys' legs at 35? My form are bigger than legs. Right, right, right. This kid got legs. So, you know what I'm saying? My Tyson legs. Okay. So camp is good. You don't have issues. Great. Can't any issues. He's very disciplined. A couple of years ago, I'd probably say no. This year, I say yes to whoever. You know what I'm saying? Any different? Any different? Hey, it's a big stage. It's a big stage he on. Techniques now. It's a big stage he on right now. You know what I'm saying? So again, he got a he got a biggest fighter up, and 
Hey, I just hope he, you know, Roley don't let you down, bro. Like, I haven't seen any of Roley's fight, but if you behind him, I'm finna tap in and check out the brother, you know what I'm saying? Because he obviously got something special if he even being offered to fight Tank Davis, who's number one ranking right now in his weight, you know what I'm saying? So, hey, I guess we're going to see. May 28, y'all get y'all TVs ready, get y'all tickets if y'all going personally, man. Hey, it's going to be a good one. Salute to Mayweather Promotion. Salute to uh, GT, GTB, I think. Salute to everybody, man, that's involved, man. Al Heyman, Showtime. Hey, my boy Bullet, once again, man, salute to you, bro. Salute to you for getting there, man, for staying the course and trusting the process, big dog. Because I remember when we was in the clubs doing our thing, like, for real, for real, you know what I'm saying? And your hands was already registered at the time. Niggas ain't even know that. You feel me? I knew. Hey, but it is what it is. Hard work pays off, my boy. With that maturity, any different techniques you're implementing in this training camp? The most important technique we implement in this camp is patience. Okay. Being sharp, tight defense. Okay. You know what I'm saying? He's a softball killer. Uh, the three softballs that we fought, he had nine knockdowns, three knockouts. The longest been seven rounds against an Olympian. Okay. I guess I got to beat Chop Chop Corey, one of the best softball in the area. Gotcha. He also beat the guy that beat Mikey Garcia last week, Mark. Mm. Yigit ain't no punk. He punked him. Okay. He's a good guy. Shout out to you, get little disrespect. But in the fight, in that, in that ring, in that ring, doggy dog. He can't handle it. Doggy dog. And when, and, when, and when he punches you, he punches me. I've been four for ten. Um, you know what I'm saying high school, high fifty seven pounds. He punches my shit. That shit vibrates. Right, okay. I'm bigger fighters, so heavyweights, like the cruiserweights, they don't punch like that. So I asked you. He, he didn't want to tell me, but so I'm gonna ask you the question. When they talk about only that has the punching power. Like what different? He says it's an awkward style. How do you? How would you describe the style? His style is very awkward. And when I start training Rody, I seen the things that. Hey, I'm just saying. If y'all ain't watched the press conference, man, go check it out. Rolando Romero versus or Tank Davis versus Rolando Romero. However you want to put it, but it's going down. May 28, baby. May 28. And guess who in the building? Belize in the building, baby. Stand up. <laughs> My boy Bullet in the building, baby. That's what I'm talking about, man. I love to see that, man. Because like I said, I knew I know this dude personally. You know what I'm saying? We used to be out there on the field playing football. When I say football, I'm talking about, y'all call it soccer. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's how we go back, back, back. Like, real talk, true story. But enough about that, man. This fight is going to be epic right here. And this put my man on a whole different, in a whole different tax bracket. Not even that, not pocket watching, but on a whole different level of his career. To where now he he has the, if they if this fight goes his way, oh man, look at here, look at here, look out world, cause this dude right here, hey, he been at it for a minute, and now it's his time. He finally got his shot. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Oh, you don't see him. Everybody wanna make him a boxer. See, professional boxing is not about boxing. That's amateur. Professional boxing about styles, styles me fights. And so his style is perfect. Like I just said, you cannot pass a test you never saw a quiz for. If you never practiced this, how could you defeat it? See, we've seen that. We've seen every style. You know what I'm saying? And with his punching power, I say power because this is what people, they're jealous and envious of power. Right. Power is a neutralizer. Right. You understand what I'm saying? If I hit you one time, flush in the face, you're not going to get dazed. You're going to sleep. You see people get put in a stretcher by this kid. They put him by the motherfucking stretcher. So so when you say styles make fights, what makes his style the right for this fight? It's a tank is a softball. We're softball killers. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? I'm a softball. He's bad. He's a softball. He has softball. Ready. He got the blueprint for softball. Gotcha. Gotcha. A lot of top trainers can't even train softballs. Gotcha. You understand? Gotcha. So long. I train softball every right now. So you see it all the time. I see it all the time. Your Pre daddy's the one of the baddest softballs. I'm coming to the late career from Keaton. Appreciate so, your time, big dog. And then his daddy's my coach. I'm going to watch him, man. Hey, it's going down. It's going down May 28th. Y'all make sure y'all get y'all TVs right, man. Get your tickets. You know what I'm saying? Because it, it's, it's definitely going down, baby. You know what I'm saying? Tank Davis versus Rolando Romero, man. Let me see if I can show y'all exactly who it is, man. Because, uh, you know what I'm saying? Go watch, go watch the, uh, go watch the interviews. Go watch the, um, there it is. They all over, they all over the place. They all over the place. These them kids right here, man. They finna get busy in the ring. You know what I'm saying? They finna get busy in the ring. But yeah, man. Let's mute that while that play right there. While that 
play right there. Skip that. Well, good afternoon, everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, there they go. There you go, my boy Bullet right there. You know what I'm saying? Boy, hey, you made it, dog. You made it. You're on that stage, man. There he is. <laughs> Salute to my guy, man. I just love to see this, though, man, because, like I said, I know this brother personally, man. I know the hard work that he put in. He was, he was, he was fighting UFC when... When niggas, I'ma just keep it real. Black people wasn't even up on UFC like that. Like this, this is, you know what I'm saying? Back when uh, what's the boy name was fighting uh, damn, what's the white boy name that was fighting? Man, I forget the, I forget his name. But back then, when he was the man, um, damn, what's his name? I forget his name. But it, the the man been around for a minute. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, he done did. He done wore many hats, man. I remember the events at the Palomino. When, you know what I'm saying, shit go, shit go sideways and this brother, like, you know what I'm saying, that's what made me, like, because we always knew each other from family, you know what I'm saying, close-knit, Belizean, but just certain situations, when you get in certain situations with certain people and you see how they act under pressure, man, that lets you know, bro, if you solid dude if never or not, and this dude right here, I take my hat off to him, solid, 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 like, for real, for real, you know what I'm saying, Kept it all the way gutter. So he on there, he keeping it professional and all that, but don't 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 get it twisted for a second and think that uh think that uh this brother ain't, ain't about ain't about what he talking about. He with the business. With the business. Salute to both of these fighters, man. Tank Davis, Rolando Romero, salute to the trainers. Like I said, salute to Barclay Center, Showtime, Mayweather Promotions, that is GTB, hey, GTD, all of you, all y'all boys, man. This gonna be epic right here, May twenty eighth. Y'all make sure y'all tap in though, tap in though. Tell a friend to tell a friend. You dig? We on one, baby. N O R E K. Make sure you hit the like button, share that thing, man, and subscribe to the channel. We gonna we gonna keep y'all up to date until the fight date. You know what I'm saying? May twenty eighth, baby. It's going down on Showtime pay per view. Get your get your TVs ready. If your internet ain't right, get you some internet. Go to the bar, do something. Watch this fight right here though. I can't wait for this one. Can't wait for this one. Ooh, it's going down. 